All right, so some good news. I finally got the manifold off. I was working on the back bolt, like way over here, and um, managed to not snap that one. Out of the 12 bolts holding this thing down, I only snapped one. And uh, I'm trying to carefully remove that, but I'm not having much luck yet. However, I found a product called um, CRC Freeze Off. I guess you, you can like spray the bolt down and it will chill it down to like negative temperatures. And apparently that would crack it and make it release. So we're gonna give that a shot, but I'm gonna go buy some. But uh, yeah, so here's the old manifold. Got it off. It looks fine, obviously. Um, here's the new one or the used replacement. And this has something extra. You see on here, this is just like a straight piece. But on here, we have some kind of venting tube that goes round. And so I don't really know what I'm gonna do with that. I feel like I need to block this because I don't really have anywhere for that vent to go. And uh, if I don't block it, the vehicle's just not gonna run right. So I gotta decide what to do with that. There's also this, this plenum um, and then this gasket that always goes bad. I've ordered a new one of these and the new gaskets and everything that we need to put on here. So I got a little bit of time to decide what I'm gonna do. But um, yeah, it's my lunch break. I got my singing lessons, gonna go do those. But later today, I'm gonna go out and buy some of that freeze off stuff. And we're gonna try and get that bolt up. So I've realized something while working on this truck, and that is it's really easy to become distracted and procrastinate. Like, <laughs> you know, I really, I want to go Uber and earn money. And uh, Michelle invited me out the other day to go get some food and go with the kids. And all of those things are things that I want to do. Um, but part of me wants to do them even more because I know that means I don't have to work on the truck. And the truck right now represents this possibility for success or failure and when i'm feeling like it's going wrong it really presents more of a you know a probability of failure and that isn't a great feeling however you know i would argue that it's a feeling that you should definitely become comfortable with because you know many successful people have to go through iterations of failure and you know maybe another word for failure is really you know just learning just <laughs> just kind of education and so I think it's an interesting thing to think about. I, I think it, it kind of goes as a pattern in a lot of things in my life. Like sometimes I feel overwhelmed. So instead of dealing with what I have to deal with, I'll go and eat something. And so that probably contributes to my weight issues. Um, but yeah, it's interesting. And so I'm, I'm trying really hard to not do other things right now, like where possible. Like if there's an option to go do something, I'm really trying to turn it down. Now, obviously I have my singing lesson that is scheduled. There are some things that sort of unavoidable but i have an option this weekend to go drive a whole bunch for uber and make a whole bunch of money however i think that before i can do that i really need to make sure that i've gotten as far as i possibly can with the truck and i think that's really kind of what priorities are really about anyway i'm gonna go to my singing lesson and then the next part of this video will probably be me buying some of that freaking freeze off stuff if i can find it All right, I got it, I'm ready. The guy at AutoZone said that this stuff is amazing. All right, just to show you that it doesn't actually want to budge, let me just lock it on. And not a super great grip, but anyway, it's definitely, definitely stuck. So what the instructions say is to basically use this little straw, spray the crap out of it for 20 seconds, and it should freeze this bolt, which should make it shrink, and then the penetrant should go into the threads and hopefully loosen it up. So, let's try it out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Well, I gave it a good shot and uh, I actually snapped a little bit more with the bolt off. I guess I'm going to leave this overnight and see if it, uh, see if it frees it up a little more. I've got the whole day Saturday to try to get this off. It's just this one bolt. <laughs> oh my god, it better come out, I swear. But uh, yeah, I'm just gonna leave this for tonight. I don't want to stress myself out about it. Um, I'll attack it tomorrow with a with a clean mind. <laughs> 